welcome to money text guru in this video we are going to learn about a very very useful formula to convert the inr per kg into usd per yard i hope this video will be a very useful video for a marketing team as well let's start today's video formula to convert inr per kg to yard per usd the details what are the details we require to convert the inr i mean indian rupee per kg to yard per usd or price per kg is required fabric width in inches is required and gsm just with three datas we can convert the inr per kg into usd per yard the formula which we use to convert the inr per kg to yard per usd it's it's a four step methodology the step 1 <clears throat> we need to identify number of meters per kg i have taken it as a the formula to convert to uh, identify the number of meters per kg is 39370 divided by fabric width in inches into fabric gs <clears throat> the the value which we get is noted as a step 2 number of yards per kg obviously our requirement is yard per usd so we need to convert that meter into yard for that that i have considered as b already we have number of meters per kg as a into 1.104 if you multiply the number of meters per kg into 1.104 we'll get number of yards per kg there is another one more formula in case uh, there are two different options we can get the same similar value one with multiplying with 1.104 or you can divide that number of meters per kg by 0.91 both will give the similar answer the step 3 is fabric price in inr per yard because in the step 2 we got already the number of yards per kg we have got and we have already the price per kg so we can just by dividing the fabric price per kg with number of yards per kg we'll get fabric price in inr indian rupee per yard that i have noted it as a c the the final one the targeted the target which we are proceeding with the fabric price in usd per yard that i have noted it is d the d is equal to c divided by usd in dollars in inr the dollar price in inr in case just by substituting the fabric price in inr divided by the usd the price the current price of dollar in inr if we divide with divide the fabric price in inr per yard by the present usd price we will get the fabric price in usd per yard very simple formulas just let's to just to apply all these things let's have an example as i told earlier we need three different values number 1 fabric price per kg i have taken it as rupees 500 fabric width in inches i have considered it as 63 inches and finally the fabric gsm 160 gs just for a what is a number of meters per kg number of meters per kg is equal to 39370 divided by fabric width in inches 63 and, and multiplied by fabric gsm 160 gsm just by applying all these three values we will get 3.905 that is number of meters per kg is 3.905 meters per kg the step b is number of yards per kg number of meters per kg need to be converted to number of yards per kg for that b is equal to the a value of a is 3.905 3.905 multiplied by 1.104 will get 4.311 4.311 yards is present in 1 kg the second the third step is c 
what is the fabric price in INR per yard? Already we have number of yard and we have the fabric price in per kg. Just by dividing 500 with 4.311, we'll get 1 rupees 115.98 per yard. Finally, the last, the fourth step, the, num the fabric price in USD per yard. Already we have the INR price in per yard. Just by dividing the present USD price, present day USD price, that is normally 72 to 74, are considered as 73 rupees. So the final answer is 1.59 USD per yard. <laughs> I hope it's a very uh, simple methodology to convert the INR per kg to uh, yard per USD. But before applying any formula, we need to understand. We need to uh, we need to understand how this formula has come, how this formula is being derived, so that the formula that will be uh, registered in our mind for a lifetime. Let's see how this the initial stage formula. 39370 divided by fabric width in inches into fabric GSM. As I told, we have three data: fabric price per kg, fabric width in inches, and GSM. In for deriving this formula, we'll be considering only two terminologies. Number one, fabric width in inches. First, let us take fabric width in inches. To convert the fabric width in inches to centimeter, will be multiplying with 2.54. For example, one inch is one. Uh, to convert one inch into centimeter, will multiply normally with two uh, 2.54. Will get 2.54 centimeter. Just with the same simple formulas. This is to convert thus convert the inches fabric width in inches to centimeter. To convert that particular fabric width in centimeter into meter, will be dividing it with 100. So, since we need a linear uh, weight, linear weight of the fabric, so we'll be multiplying with the GSM, so that we'll get the linear width, linear width of the fabric within grams. And to convert that grams into kgs, we'll be dividing it with 1000, so that with this relation, we will be getting fabric width in linear meter in kg. That I have considered it as x. Just with the relation, we will take two, uh, two related uh, relations here. With this relation, we can declare that x kg, x kg of fabric is x kg of fabric has 1 meter. Similarly, the ultimate our uh, target is to know in how in 1 kg of fabric how many meters is there. Just with the two relationship, just a simple formula, simple combination in school day, school day calculations, school day mathematics, just cross multiplying with each other x into m. That will be mx is equal to 1 into 1 is 1. So, since we need m, m is equal to 1 by x. The same thing we have applied it here. Just substituting the value of x here, m is equal to 1 divided by fabric width in inches into, I have just uh, reversed gsm into, uh, gsm I have taken it front and 2.54 I have taken it at last. GSM into 2.54 divided by 100 into 1000 that is 1 lakh. Again simplifying this equation M is equal to 1 divided by fabric width in inches. I am just uh, dividing divided 2.54 with 1 lakh. We got we will get 1 divided by 0 0.00000254. Just the value of this is 39370.078 divided by fabric width in inches into GSM. M is number of meters per kg. This is the formula. This is the way it got 
identified and it got substituted here. I hope this video is very useful and informative. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe the channel and refer this video to your friends for effective utilization. Thank you. See you all in the next video. Till then, bye from your Money Text Group.